The concept of cleaner production was developed to promote the application of pollution-free production in industrial companies and the incorporation of concept in the national environmental legislation of developing countries. Over the years, Malaysia, like other industrialized nations, has progressively taken different approaches to deal with environmental degradation and pollution problems by ignoring the problem. This happened during the late 50s and 60s when Malaysia has just gained her independence. Diluting or dispersing the pollution so that its effects are less harmful or apparent. Controlling pollution using end of pipe treatment and disposal. With the introduction of Environmental Quality Act of 1974 and the establishment of the Department of Environment, Malaysia. Standard for discharge and emission has been set for industries to comply with the regulation. Preventing pollution and waste at the source through a cleaner production. Due to the international trends and practices, Malaysia has also shifted its efforts towards implementing cleaner production and clean technology processes with the hope of minimizing and preventing generation of pollution. The key difference between pollution control and cleaner production is that pollution control is an after-the-event, react-and-treat approach, whereas Cleaner production is proactive and preventive approach, tackling pollution and waste problem. Dependence on end-of-pipe solution is reduced or in some cases eliminated altogether. Cleaner production emphasizes the integration of manufacturing processes and pollution control processes for the purposes of cost saving and waste minimization. Cleaner production is a practical method for protecting human and environmental health and for supporting the goal of sustainable development. Failure of implementing cleaner production in the industry will increase the cost of waste treatment and disposal. Cleaner production is defined as the continuous application of an integrated preventive environmental strategy applied to processes, products and services to increase eco-efficiency and reduce risks to humans and the environment. It can be applied to the processes used in any industry, to product themselves and to various services provided in society. Cleaner production means the continuous application of an integrated preventive environmental strategy to processes, products and services to increase efficiency and reduce risks to humans and the environment. In the long run, Cleaner production is the most effective way to design and operate industrial processes and to develop and produce products and services. The cost of waste and emissions, including negative environmental and health impacts, can be avoided or minimized by applying the cleaner production concept continuously and throughout the entire life cycle. It is a preventive approach rather than reactive. Implementing cleaner production may not solve all environmental problems at a facility, but it will decrease the need for end-of-pipe equipment and create less toxic waste to treat and dispose. It often reduces workers' exposure to hazardous chemicals and usually reduces the number of accidents that can harm surrounding areas. Products that are designed and produced with cleaner production in mind are often less harmful for consumers to use and their residuals are normally less of a burden to waste streams. The key elements of cleaner production definition are encourages continuous application, is not limited only to manufacturing industries or businesses of a certain type or size does not deny or impede growth but insists that growth can be ecologically sustainable. 
considers life cycle impacts of producing goods and providing services, includes health and safety and emphasizes risk reduction, improves immediate efficiency as well as long time efficiency, win-win situation for the environment, community and business. Cleaner production options relate not only to changing equipment but also to the operation and management of the company. Cleaner production options can be grouped into better housekeeping, process optimization, raw material substitution, new technology and new product design. Options to implement cleaner production can be as straightforward as adopting better housekeeping practices. Better housekeeping refers to change in operational procedures and management in order to eliminate waste and emission generation. It will improve inventory management, material storage, material handling and organization of workplace, awareness and training to staff. Process optimization may involve more complex measures associated with processes and products. Product optimizations change the product characteristics such as shape and material composition. Rationalize and optimize production processes or operational practices. Modify process sequence or modify operating parameters. Raw material substitution can be implemented to substitute hazardous or banned raw materials with safer and eco-friendly alternatives in the processes. The more sophisticated options may include switching to renewable energy sources, increasing material efficiency and reusing and recycling by-products. The product itself can be designed to reduce consumption of resources to prolong its useful life and to allow disassembly and recycling of its component parts. There are two approaches in the elements of environmental management, reactive and preventive approaches. The goal of sustainable development can be driven through regulation and responsibility focusing on waste, facility and life cycle. Cleaner production is a practical method for protecting human and environmental health and for supporting the goal of sustainable development. The adoption of the Environmental Management System ISO 14001 was the issue of continuous process improvement to reduce the impact of their process and products on the environment. An EMS creates the framework in which the opportunities of cleaner production can be realized. Applying a management system in the enterprises and constantly improving it leads to better risk management and a reduced negative impact on the environment and can yield economic benefits and increase market shares. After applying CPEMS, urgent environmental issues of enterprises can be solved. By adopting the CPEMS approach, companies are able to address the issue of continuous improvement. Applying CP and EMS generates economic savings for enterprise by improving the overall efficiency of its processes. ISO 14001 offers a common standard approach based on the PDCA cycle. While ISO 14001 integrates the basics of impact assessment and scenario building, it does not clearly distinguish between pollution control and pollution prevention. Thus, ISO 14001 certification is possible with end-of-pipe efforts alone and need not mandate improvement in environmental performance. Cleaner production places emphasis on pollution prevention rather than control with clear improvement in environmental performance. Many businesses do not realize how much money they lose in wasted materials, energy and water or through handling 